Aesthetic hair removal is a practice as old as civilization. And when we understand the microscopic science of hair growth, we can use our improved and advanced methodology of an ancient practice in a way that may prove more effective and permanent than many modern techniques. The key to success with pro-sugaring treatments is to extract each hair with its entire root, including the bulb, intact. This must be done early during its growth phase, known as antigen. During antigen, a special pool of stem cells, known as the matrix, multiplies and forms the base of the hair root bulb. As the new matrix cells mature, they surround and enclose the dermal papilla and migrate upwards to form the distinct layers that make up the hair and its supporting tissue. At the core of all of this growth is the dermal papilla, which feeds and provides growth signals to the stem cells in the matrix. The phase after antigen is catagen, when the papilla separates from the hair root bulb. Then the hair follicle lies dormant in telogen phase until the hair naturally sheds or is removed. During these phases, extraction causes no disruption to hair growth other than temporary removal. However, by extracting the hair in its natural direction of growth during early antigen, the blood vessels in the dermal papilla and stem cells can be partially or fully removed or disrupted while they are still active in producing the new hair. Permanent results, initially exhibiting as gradual weakening and refinement of the hair, might be explained by a buildup of microscopic scarring in the blood vessels, reducing their ability to signal and support new hair growth. Another cause may also be the incremental depletion of the pool of stem cells that the follicle draws upon each new antigen phase. A trained technician can predict the antigen phase and time treatments to optimize results. Extraction of the hair at the wrong angle can cause hair breakage, eliminating the treatment's effect on hair regrowth. When applied properly, the sugar penetrates deep into the follicle to grip each hair and gently remove them whole with the root bulbs intact. Laser hair removal effectiveness decreases when the hairs are too light or the skin too dark. In these cases, sugaring is an ideal alternative thanks to its consistent results and effectiveness across skin and hair types. Sugaring with proper technique at least three times with two week intervals will ensure that all new hairs from that point forward are in the antigen phase. Because of their naturally staggered growth timing, the immediate effect is that less hair will be exposed at any given time. After six months, it's possible for the effects to reach permanent reduction, depending on hormonal influence. For more information on body sugaring and healthy skin care, visit alexandriaprofessional.com.